Alright, hey guys, it's me, and today I want to talk about one of the one of the dumbest freaking things I've ever read in my life. Are you guys ready to hear this? Parodists have, have it rough these days, since so much of modern life and culture resembles the Babylon Bee. What the fuck is the Babylon Bee? You got me. If anybody out there knows, please let me know. The latest evidence is that the, is that Stanford University administrators in May published a index of forbi- uh, index of forbidden words to be eliminated from the school's website and computer. Co- what the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? And provided include and provide inclusive replacements to help re-educate the benight benighted. What the fuck is benight does benighted even mean? To help re educate what? The wrong? Or people who actually know what they're talking about? What the fuck? Call yourself an American? Please don't. I say please do. Better to say US citizen. Bullshit. Per the bias bias hunters. At least let lest you cite the rest of the America lest you slight the rest of the Americas. Wrong. So people in South America they don't call their citizens Americans now, do Americans now, do they? No. Do people in Mexico call their peoples Americans? No. Get this next one, guys. Immigrant is also out with person who has immigrated. Bullshit. Again, immigrant is just fine. As the approved alternative. Fuck you. It's the I it's the iron law of academic writing. No, it isn't. Why use one word when four will do? I say why use four when one word will do will do just fine. You can't ma- you can't master your subject at Stanford any longer. In case you hadn't heard, the schools instruct that historically masters enslaved people. That is stupid, and and also, and also Stanford is full of shit. And don't you dare, and don't de- and don't dare design a blind study. Which unintentionally perpetuates that disability is somehow abnormal or negative, furthering an, ab- an, ab- an ableist culture. What a load of shit. Blind studies are good and useful, but never mind. Mass study is to be preferred. Fuck you again. Follow the science? Not at all. I will not be following this crap. Gangbusters is banned. Because the index says it invokes the notion of police action against gangs in a positive light, which may have racial undertones. Again, you're full of shit. Fuck you, Stanford. Again. Not to beat a dead horse, a phrase that indicates normal violence against animals. What the fuck you talking about? No, what I think not what I think beating a dead horse means is you're basically talking about something that's been literally talked about to death, and basically people are ta- a lot of people have talked about it. You dumb fuck. But you used to have to get a graduate degree in the humanities to write something that stupid. You got that right. Those last four words: write something that stupid. You got that right. That's pretty much what this whole article is. That's what this whole thing is, people. This is fucking stupid, and it pretty much proves that Stanford, that Stanford University, is full of it. Okay. I'm sorry, people, but you can't, according to these morons, you can't call yourself an American anymore. I'm sorry, but um, what country do we currently live in? Um, what's that? What's this country called again? Oh yeah, the United States of America. You fuck, you fucking idiots. 
You have to say U.S. citizen? Fuck you. That's bullshit. You can't say immigrant anymore? Bullshit. You can. I say... And, and they say, why use one word when four will do? No, I say, why use four words when one will do just fine? And it basically gets your point across, you, f- you fucking idiots. And you can't master your subject at Stanford any longer? Yes, you can. Because what's that? What's the highest degree that you can get from a, from a college nowadays? Oh yeah, a master's degree. Call me call me crazy here, people. But this right here proves that Stanford University is completely full of shit, and Stanford University is is full is full of these dumbest people I've ever heard of in my life. And, this, and the university administrators, you should be ashamed of yourselves and you should t- and you should basically resign right now because you clearly don't know what you're talking about. Because you want you want people to use to use to use words that make no sense and words that really have no reason to exist. And people, if this if let me tell you guys. If people have start using this words in everyday speech, I say don't. I say don't. I say don't do it. I say just just say what you want and say what you will. And if you can use one word to basically get your point across, that's fine. And a master and a master's degree is basically the highest degree you can get from a college. Thank you very much. Or a university. Thank you very much. <sighs> to you, Stanford University, I say, go fuck yourself, you cocksucking motherfuckers, and shove this up your ass. And shove your and shove your PC PG bullcrap up your ass. So people, I say, say what you want and say what you will, because to Stanford University, I really don't give a damn.